Hey, what's up guys? This is Akshay from AS Learning and today we'll be seeing how to implement a grammar checker in Python. So can we say that are we implementing a clone of Grammarly? Well, I'll say the most basic version of Grammarly. So Grammarly comes up with lots of features. It comes up with suggestions. It has a very intuitive UI. It automatically catches from the text you're writing. And it also goes into much more detail understanding like your grammar context and all right but when grammarly was started definitely it was from the most basic versions and we'll be seeing how to implement that first basic version in python okay so first of all we all know what grammar is okay and uh, this uh, video in this video we'll be seeing about the grammar for english language okay so majorly for grammar checker what happens is uh, there are two packages which are uh, very popular uh, for grammar checker and they are completely open source the first one is gingerit uh, the other one is uh, language tool language tool i'll show you the other one is language tool So language tool is uh, one of the package which is very highly used when it comes to grammar checker uh, yeah this one i think so then the other one is uh, grammar check and you can also find many other packages also and uh, yeah, you can definitely check them out too but uh, from my personal experience gr this language tool is the one uh, which is highly used and apart from that we have uh, gingerit they also have a paid version of this uh, in the form of an api and uh, yeah uh, then you also have tools like grammarly and other free open source tools also okay now let's go to the python code yeah so here uh, what we have done is first of all we have installed uh, gingerit and then i've imported uh, gingerit from the package of gingerit i've taken a wrong grammatical sentence so here my text is narendra modi is our prime minister uh, he is from gujarat okay so let's make it is our prime minister uh, dot he is from gujarat i have just created object of gingerit and uh, run my parser over the text okay let's do one thing let's first uh, see what functionalities are done by the free version of gingerit yeah so here you can see that uh, it it has passed the entire sentence and uh, it has come up with three mistakes so the first mistake is the spelling of gujarat is not right uh, it, it is telling it is also giving me the index at which the error is what is a text and what is the correct version for a text okay then we also have uh, the definition for the region that is it's a region of western india to, to the north of bombay then uh, the other correction uh, which we have is uh, dot okay so it has uh, it is saying that it wants a space okay that's interesting it wants a space there uh, then we have the other correction of uh, minister the spelling of minister and the last one is of prime okay so i think so in english grammar whenever uh, you write it down i think there needs to be a space like this this is something which i have seen many times but let's cross check it yeah generally while writing any mails and all we see such kind of errors yes so wow th this was not expected and this is really nice so it shows uh, how good this package is and if you want to uh, do any uh, calculation kind of stuff like how many grammar grammar errors are there in this text just print the length of this dictionary or i'll say list a uh, list of dictionary and that should do your work so in this way we are getting the the areas where my text was wrong we are also getting the corrections and uh, we are also we are also numerically telling like how many grammar mistakes are present in that text okay so that's it with this guys uh, i'll really suggest you explore other packages also like language tool it is a very good package 
um and yeah do try to compare these packages with how efficiently or, or in what level it is there with uh, grammarly and other uh, paid apis which are there uh, available in the market yeah so that's it with this video guys if you like this video give it a thumbs up share it with all your python machine learning ai friends and uh, stay tuned to as learning for more such amazing tech stuff take care peace out